we are going to discuss a very very important topic of linear programming problem and in this topic we are discussing how to generate basic feasible solution from a given set of feasible solution of a system okay and in this problem consider the set of equation the equation are given by x1 a1 plus x2 a2 plus x3 a3 this is equal to b where a1 a2 a3 and b are given and then show that x1 this is equal to 2 this is equal to 3 this is equal to 1 is a solution of the above set of equation is the above set sorry above solution is basic generate another feasible solution with is basic sorry this is not with this is which which is basic that is we have to generate a basic feasible solution starting from the feasible solution okay this is the feasible solution we first write the system of equation as this is x1 into a1 means 2 3 plus x2 into this is a2 this means 1 1 plus x3 into this is 4 5 this is equal to b this is 11 40 so the equation or system can be written as 2 x1 plus x2 plus 4 x3 this is equal to 11 and 3 x1 plus x2 plus 5 x3 this is equal to 40 and this is the system of equation we name this is 1 okay now putting the value putting x1 this is equal to 2 x2 this is equal to 3 and x3 this is equal to 1 we get clearly that this is 4 plus 3 plus 4 that is 11 and this is also satisfied since both side is 40 okay so given solution given solution is a feasible solution feasible solution of the given system because since all xj greater equal to 0 for j this is equal to 1 2 3 right so we prove already that is this given set of solution is a solution and it is also a feasible solution because all of xj greater equal to 0 now here number of equation that is m this is equal to 2 and number of number of variable that is n this is equal to 3 because the number of variable x1 x2 x3 this is 3 hence in any basic solution any basic solution at least n minus m that is 3 minus 2 this is equal to 1 variable must be 0 ok but in our given set of solution there will be no variable to 0 ok so we say that the given set is not a basic solution of the given system so given set of solution is not basic okay this is the first two part of the problem and the most important part is this now we have to generate the basic feasible solution from the given set of feasible solution. Here, three given vector that is a1, a2, and a3. 
these three must be are the vector of two dimension that is belongs to r2 okay and we know that in a two dimensional vector space three vector always be linearly dependent that is we also know at most two vector of r2 may be linearly independent okay so we have say that a1 a2 a3 belongs to r2 must be linearly dependent hence there exist lambda 1 lambda 2 lambda 3 not all zero such that a1 lambda 1 plus a2 lambda 2 plus a3 lambda 3 this is equal to zero and we get two equation or two relation from this relation by equating the first component we get 2 into lambda 1 plus 1 into lambda 2 plus 4 into lambda 3 2 into lambda 1 plus 1 into lambda 2 plus 4 into lambda 3 this is equal to 0 because right side is 0 and equating the second component we get 3 into lambda 1 plus 1 into lambda 2 plus 5 into lambda 3 this is equal to 0 now by cross multiplication we get lambda 1 by lambda 2 by and lambda 3 by okay and lambda 1 by this is 5 minus 1 this is 1 lambda 2 by this is this is 12 minus 10 this is 2 and lambda 3 by this is minus 1 okay now our aim to reduce the number of non zero variable here given three non zero variable but in any basic feasible solution or any basic solution of this system must contain at least one variable to be zero so our aim is reduce the number of positive variable of the solution okay and how to reduce it here we get three value lambda 1 by 1 lambda 2 by 2 and lambda 3 by 3 now we choose xr by lambda r. what is xr by lambda r? this is minimum of minimum of xi by lambda i where lambda i greater than 0 okay so we get this is minimum of what is xi x i means x1 this is 2 by 1 because lambda 1 this is 1 this is greater than 2 and the second one is 3 by 2 3 by 2 because here lambda 2 this is equal to 2 this is also positive and clearly we get 3 by 2 that is 3 by 2 means x2 by lambda 2 x2 by Lambda two. That is, we get R. This is equal to two. Now, what are the new variable? How to find the new variable? The formula of finding new variable or new solution is given by x i cap. This is equal to x i minus x r by lambda into into lambda r sorry this is lambda r and we get the formula as x i minus x r by lambda r means 3 by 2 this is 3 by 2 into lambda i so we get x1 cap this is x1 cap and which is given by this is x i this is 2 minus this is 3 by 2 into this is 1 so this is given by half x2 cap this is x2 x2 means 
minus 3 by 2 into this is lambda 2 so this is 2 so 3 minus 3 this is 0 and x3 cap this is given by 1 minus 3 by 2 into minus 1 so this gives the result 5 by 2 so we get a basic feasible solution of the system as this is given by half 0 5 by 2 okay since all the variables are greater equal to 0 so we say this this equation sorry this solution must be feasible and since one at least one variable be 0 so this is basic feasible solution okay and we can done the same thing by another process we changing the process from here okay here we can take xr by lambda r this is max xi by lambda i such that lambda i less than 0 here only one lambda i this is lambda 3 is given which is negative so we write directly here this is max of xi means xi means this 1 by minus 1 so this is minus 1 and the formula in this case also same and the formula becomes new xi cap this is given by xi minus this is x r by lambda which is minus 1 here so this is minus 1 into into lambda i okay now new x1 cap this is x1 minus sorry this is plus into lambda 1 which is lambda 1 this is 1 so this is 1 and given x1 is 2 so this is 3 x2 cap x2 cap which is x2 cap x2 cap means this is 3 plus lambda 1 sorry lambda 2 lambda 2 means 2 this is 2 so this is 5 and x3 sorry this is x3 cap x3 cap means x3 this is 1 plus lambda sorry lambda 3 lambda 3 means again minus 1 so this is 0 and in this case we get the solution as 3 5 0 and this is also a basic feasible solution of the system we can done in any one of this method either we taking lambda i greater than 0 or we taking lambda i less than 0 ok and this is very very important problem of your exam and we get two answers two different answers but if we put this value of x1 x2 x3 in the given system we see that this is satisfied equation 1 ok or system 1 also if we put this value of x1 x2 x3 here also this satisfy the equation ok so we get the basic feasible solution from the given set of feasible solution right thank you thank you for watching